The first game we're going to do tonight is simply extraordinary. This one's going to bring tears to your eyes. If you don't cry about this, you are a sadist straight up. And I know there might be some of you sick puppies out there who are like, oh, oh, oh this is funny. It could be funny. But this is tragic. This is tragic. We're going to start in this position. It is an absolutely wild position, this game, played by Voigt and Neumeier. It is a German championship under 20 tournament. This position is sick. That's all we can say. Position is sick. Look at this. White has four, count them, four connected passers, despite the fact that Black has a pawn on the A file. And that's because these pawns are on the, this pawn's on the other side. It's not on A7 slowing things down. It's on A4, meaning that a pass pawn is also had by black. Did I hear some crypto donation just happen? Is that what just happened? That I heard I heard something just blow up on my stream. Oh, it's Spenderpunk still going wild. All right, I feel you, Spenderpunk. Thank you. You're, you're going wild. I can't even, I can't even, I can't, I can't keep track. Let's get back to the action. This is the position. White has four connected passers, but black has two of them as well. Two passers, not connected, but two of them. Not only that, at the moment, Black is up in exchange. We see here that Black has these two rooks. And uh, you guys are really distracting me with all this generosity, by the way. It's, it's, it's getting ridiculous. So I'm going to try to focus. But thank you. So the, the exchange. So these things, this is just a sick position. So White didn't want to trade off. So White played rook to f4. Attacking the queen. And now black play the move queen to e5. All right. And now queen to f1. Played. So in this position, again, it's a wild, it's a crazy, it's a busy position right now. Thank you, weapon. Much appreciated. I will keep the content going. So in this position, black has to figure out what to do. Because white is trying to generate some threats. And what Black did was what a lot of us instinctively might do, is get greedy. Chess is one of those games that will punish you for being greedy, all right? So Black realized that E2 was not playable. This looks like a natural move. Attack the queen, but White had a nice little trap waiting, and that was, boom, give me your pawn. Thank you. And when you take, bing, 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 oops, uh, <laughs> what, happened? Oh, what, 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 hap what happened here? Now, there might be some chances. I'm not going to bother you with the variations. A little bit of something like this. A little something like this. But white is able to squelch this distraction. Obviously, you can't take because of a little Matutsky action with this move, bishop to d4. And count the four passers that are going down the board while the bishop stops the pawn from going anywhere. And black just can't quite get that counter spaghetti going in this game, all right? So that's not going to work. So Black realized that in this position, E2 didn't work. Now, the move Black should have played, remarkable move, by the way, is A3. Push the other one. What? <laughs> like, it's all the way over there. Why are we doing that? Especially with the move Bishop D4 on tap. Well, after Queen takes and Rook down to F7, serious move, G7 is just... Tenderoni. Now rook to g8 defense. And after it takes, gotta go for the counterplay. Looking for the trades. This pawn is always speaking to white. Notice none of white's pawns are going anywhere. They're not going anywhere. So really, white's just fighting with the pieces, trying to overwhelm black and distract black. Meantime, this pawn is like, you keep trading and see what happens. All right. This one's going down the board. So a move like bishop to c5. I said I wasn't going to show the variations. I can't help myself. I did the work. Why not? Takes, takes. And now takes this B hop. Queen takes d7 and a2. And check this out. Queen a4. Got to stop that pawn. Queen to e2. Guarding the pawn and threatening Matutsky. And after h3, a little queen b2 action. You get what I'm saying? Black would have had real counterplay with the a pawn. That's what should have happened. a3, the right move. Instead, in this position, Black decided to play queen takes on c3. Now, this is called greed. Let me put my chat over here so I can make sure you guys are still here. All right. 
How did he get there? Chipotle Sensei, it's pretty easy, you know. He could have taken a piece. Just something was there. Knight was on A4 and something captured, no problem. I, I assume that's what you're referring to. But Queen takes C3, that's called greed. And that's a straight, stone cold blunder. Because now Bishop D4 and trouble is afoot. And that foot is going to be right up his rear in a second, all right? You know what I'm saying? That's what's going to happen. This trouble is going to be a big foot. Here we go. Queen to D2. So now, this is what Black thought was going to be the counterplay, all right? This is what Black thought was going to be good. Except in this position, White, from nothing it looks like, right? Well, we were not even talking about a mating attack. White now has a killer blow. Now, this is where... You're going to feel, this is where the, 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 the soap opera begins. All right. The soap opera starts here. The other stuff was just a little like intro. You know, it's like when you're watching Star Wars and you see the beginning and it goes once upon a time in a galaxy far away. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I want to watch the movie. All right. This is what that was. I just give you all that. Now the true soap opera begins because here White has a win. Cold. Straight up. Game over, and it's beautiful. What should White have done in this position? You guys know it. Boom! Hit him in the face. Just hit him in the face. Just right in the face. Bam! Hit him. Let's open you up like a can of sardines. Now, here's the deal. This is what's lovely about this position. Black can either take it or not. Let's do takes first. Let's do takes. After takes, this check. You think it was Rook F7. I know y'all had like Rook F7. Let's do Rook F7. No, the king would have stepped back, and that would have been that. That would have been nothing. No, I nada. Okay? There's nothing there. You would have been served. You would have been like, oh, I, th I thought I had something. I could take that, but then Rook F8. Oh, man, what did I do? I messed this up. Did I mess this up? Or what? Or even a queen of two check just to shut things down. Okay. That doesn't work. The key move is this beautiful. Dude, look at the look at this sideways move. Look at that. You know when this queen's like, I can go sideways. <laughs> I can go sideways. The bishop sacked along the diagonal, and I can go sideways. The queen is a beast. You feel me? The queen is a straight up gangster. Queen A1 check. Don't step up because something's landing on F6, and you're going to die. So you got to step back. And now bishop to C4 check. Whoop! Look at the diagonal power. Oh, man. There's all kinds of nastiness. Give me some of that. Give me some of that. Got coverage down the line. What you going to do now? Well, I'm going to play bishop e6 is what I'm going to do. Time to get served. Check. Oh, look at this bishop being stretched. Oh, the pin. Oh, you can't do anything. Oh, just suffer and feel this. Boom, L right now. That's mate. Nasty. That's just like white's like. Mm, mm, mm. That was vicious. So bishop g7 check. We've established you dare take that b hop and you're done. All right. Done. Finished. All right. Don't take it though. Check, you say, let me sidestep. I'm going to sidestep. Well, here comes the bishop. We know what's going to happen. <laughs> take that bishop. You dare take my bishop. You know the pain's coming. So you don't want to take the bishop. Okay, you're going to block. Okay, blocking is good. But guess what's going to happen to you? We're just going to trade off pieces. And we're just going to drop inside your house. Oh, hello. Huh, we're here. We're here. We're not invited. Oh, that's too bad. You got to take that. Because if you take the real queen drops. Oh, man. Oh, my king is getting flushed out. No, may I survive? No, you're not surviving. No, 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 no. There's no survival. What survival? You're dead. Finish. Bye-bye. You're out. White could have won the game, folks. Right here. Sack the bishop. Queen A1 and all kinds of nasties. Did White see that? Unfortunately, White did not. So, White instead played bishop to D3. Okay, okay, we feel you. You didn't see it. Brought the two bishops in the right direction. We got you. Pointing both of them, threatening some sacrifice. We got you. It's coming. It's coming. All right. So black, in pure desperation, played eight six. All right, hold on. Black could have also tried e two, folks. E two. All right. Could have been tried. Could have been tried. Well, uh, of course we know what's gonna happen. Boom, boom, boom. Let's take this pain. This is what he had planned. Of course, if you now take, now this check works great. This is what he had done to be able to play bing, bing, force you onto a dark square and mate. Oh, now we understand the point of what white did. Makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. Okay. 
white is still doing great. We got you. We got you. Okay, so black played the move 8 6. We feel you. That, that's, that makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. By the way, you might think, well, why not play this and just stop the bishop g7 once and for all? Let's just shut it down. Well, you could shut that down, but um, what about Tenderoni on the a7 square now that you can't even push your pawn because you're pinned? Whoops! Uh, um, oh, I didn't see that. Okay, okay. We got that straight. We straightened that one out. All right, now. Two double barrel bishops, laser like, sacrifices waiting. This is over, right? 8 6 play, trying to give a little air, squeeze him, air him. Now, does that look like air? <laughs> the bishop is guarding 8 7. How is that air? All we got to do is boom, just hit him. Keep the party going. Hit hard. You know you can't touch that. Don't. This is the MC Hammer variation. We already looked at Rook F7 and Bishop A7, so you can't touch it. Now the king can move, and now the nasty can come. Bishop back. I like it when you go forward and you go back. It's always great. It's like the step back in basketball. I'm thinking Steph Curry, y'all. Forward, step back. Ding. All right, now it's all over. It's all over. Play Bishop E6 to try to cover the long diagonal. You know what happens to you? This is sweet. Watch this. Bing, 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 bing. What is this about? Well, after you take it, no, we're not going to this diagonal. Why don't you try, boom, this nasty move. Ooh, sack a rook, sack a bishop. Stop it. Queen of seven, Matutski in your face. Did y'all see that? Let's back that up. <laughs> we're just going to go right here and say it's mate in three. Feel this variation. This is pretty stuff. All right. Check. That simply has to be captured. All squares covered. Check. That has to be captured. Me! That's nasty. Hang, hang, hang. You're over. You're done. Go home. All White had to do was sacrifice. Just sacrifice the bishop. Just do it already. Nah. White said, look at this. I'm going to say White was in time trouble. I'm just going to say it was move 36. White's in time trouble. White's just playing instinctively. That's going to be my excuse. All right? That's what I'm going to mean. I'm going to say that. Must have been. Rook S7 looks like a boss, gangster, killer, death, blow. Everybody's under attack. Everything's going to happen to you bad right now. This is This looks over, over. This looks done, son. You feel me? We this has got to be over, right? <sighs> okay. So, in total, that's by the way, rook g8 again. Why not rook g8? Well, boom! Stop it! You cannot defend with your rook. You know what's going to happen to you? Another boom! That bishop move. White was a genius. Although your bishop takes g7, but you know what I'm saying? It's over and done. Why? You you want to take my rook? Gift and Matutski. Just 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 dance all over his face. It's just painful. Okay, so that means this is over. So Black said, all right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do one last try. We're gonna just throw the pawn. Just throw it. Just throw it up there, all right? It's about to become a queen. How bad can it be? How bad can it be? Well, well, we know how bad it is because it's easy, right? It's easy. Okay, thank you, New Chan. We know what the answer is, no question. Boom! <laughs> Boom! Hey, take this. White finally did it. We've been waiting for this move. We've been waiting for it. Like, finally. Jeez. Whew. And then, boom, hit him again. White is looking like a hero now. You do it, my man. Roll on. Do it to him. Do it. Get him. Get him. King takes. Now, the sad part happens. <laughs> this bishop has exactly nine different moves, okay? That's one, that's, let's start, that's one, that's two, that's three, that's four, that's five, that's six, that's seven. That's eight, and that's nine. 
Nine. Did we say nine moves? Nine different moves. Okay. Let's analyze for starters the move bishop to a1. Well, clearly, as far as black knows, if black, if black comes up the board, we don't have to calculate. Do we have to? All right, fine, whatever. If black comes up the board, for completion's sake, rook check, king goes up the board, queen check, king's got to keep going, pawn check, king comes up the board, and how do you want to get mated? It's your choice, okay? So you cannot come up the board when the bishop goes back to a1. We got that part. But if you go backwards, check, you go here. Now, a lot of us would be like, oh, disco, that'd be sweet. That prolongs the mate, the game. No need. Just check immediately. Bing, bye, you're finished. It's over, okay? If you go here, then that's mate. And if you take, then echo, that's mate, all right? So bishop a1, that's game. It's over. Uh, excuse us all. But bishop e5 is the exact same thing as is bishop e d4 and c3 and b2. All of these retreats win on the spot. Mate's coming. Knock, knock. Uh, the Grim Reaper is outside. All of them. Well, you say, well, Maurice, what about, um, what about another one? Let's call it bishop to f8. Let's be fancy. Well, that's pretty good, too. That, that's pretty good too because don't we're not going to calculate this one we already know what happens king back we can play check nice check by the way with the bishop on the f8 square that's stylish i like that that's called style points bishop f8 that's stylish king over and check style points this is the prettiest one forget about the rest the, the, on the long diagonal retreat. That's for boring people. Bishop F8, people. This is for superstars. That's that's how you do it. You settle on the other person's back rank. And mo, that's it. Okay. So we've just shown, as we back up, that you could play one of six moves along this diagonal and a seventh move here. And you're fine. You're winning. However, you might try to get slick with this one and say this one wins too. That one wins too. I mean, that's winning, isn't it? That's winning. After all, when you take me, uh, checkmate, <laughs> it's over. If you come on the board, we know that's death. Except, except there's this little problem here because now the bishop's on the other side. And, uh, now when we play check, there's no bishop here defending our rook. So king takes, and what happened to our win? Luckily, we still have a draw with rook eight seven. King takes, check, king back, check, king over, check, and we still have a draw. We didn't want no stinking draw, but at least we have a draw. So bishop h8, horrible, tossing the win away, just like, ah. Who wants a draw in this position? Well, you know, damn straight, white didn't want a draw. And white's like, uh-uh, I don't want no stinking draw. So we got six wins here, a seventh win there, and that's a draw. Time for the tears, folks. <laughs> because there's only one move that actually loses the game. Loses the game. And that's this one. Check. Now you say, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. That bishop attacks the queen. That check is on. You can't take because it's going to be murderer's row. When the queen shows up, it's going to be painful. And it was move 39 too. White was one move away. One move away from time, time control. Black said, "Um, um but, but, but excuse me, what if I just back up? What if I just back up? <laughs> now, you can have my queen, because guess who I'm taking? With check, by the way. Your rook will be hanging. You gotta back out. I got a lot of extra pieces on the board waiting for you. I can't, you can't touch my queen. And when you try this check, oh, slide to the right. Well, it's the black's left. Now what? I mean, no, he's like, what? 
Wait, what? Huh? I mean, the queen's supposed to hang. Uh, this is game, by the way. This is what happened. Now it's move 40. And now uh, there's nothing to do. Your queen's hanging. So you play check. This worked before, right? It was a draw before somehow, maybe? Give me that. You ain't getting no draw. Your bishop is hanging on 8-6 now. Shut down. You're like, uh, I was like, what just happened? All well, my pieces are gone. But but maybe I have a perpet. Maybe with a check. Uh, I mean, your king goes back. I just keep checking you. No, the king's not going to go back. Uh-uh. The king's got friends. The king's got friends. This is like Joey and, and, and Rachel and Ross. The king's got friends. Queen's coming. Bishop's coming. You got nothing. You're getting served. Try to play a check. We're dancing now. Oh, oh, the dancing shoes are on. Another check. Move it on over. Oh, oh, the king's going to go up the board, around the board. Escort this guy. Escort this guy. Your checks are running out rapidly. And now king f6, just to make it really just mm, nasty. We're not going anywhere. We're going to actually watch you in your face. Your last check. Queen G5, oh, <laughs> the inhumanity of it. <laughs> White had to resign in this position. This could not have happened. This is what happened in the game? It ain't right, folks. It ain't right. <laughs> now, we pluck up the line with one of our pass pawns, extra pieces everywhere. <laughs> I mean, look at it. Look at this nonsense. Look at this nonsense. Like, Black's like, what you doing, son? What, what's the deal? What's the deal? This is painful. Chess is brutal. <laughs> Chess is brutal. If you want to see more of these videos, don't forget to click the subscribe button. And please follow me on twitch.tv slash GMAshley.